My name's Robbie Phillips and I'm from Edinburgh in Scotland. My climbing trip to Australia, originally the plan was to go to Taipan Wall and try and climb all the classics on that wall, but after the Northern Grampians got burned, I had to cancel that and instead went to the Arapoli. Punk in the Gym is something that I've heard about for years from lots of friends, um, particularly lots of Australian friends who have dreamed about doing it. And so after my first week in the Arapolis, just getting used to the style, I went for Punks in the Gym. It came together pretty quickly. First day on it, managed to do all the moves. Second day on it, got some really big links, and then the third day I sent. Um, well, climbing in Australia, the first thing is the, the weather is always good, so you don't have to worry about the route being wet. The second, well, the second difference is most of the climbing is sandstone. Punks in the gym was unlike anything I'd ever climbed before. The sandstone is very fine. It feels a lot like you're climbing a massive Fontainebleau-esque boulder problem for 30 meters. A lot of the times, you're not actually putting your foot on any edges; it just smears all the edges are sloping and round the sides of these sort of little rampy sort of uh, bum shaped holes uh, is really interesting and I think because of that formation of the rock it creates a really unique and very technical style that's really hard to read and you're just very body position dependent you can't just muscle your way up through any of the moves I guess that's why it's called punks in the gym I think it was uh, sort of saying, you know, punks in the gym just can't come along and climb this, you can't just be strong, you can't just be a strong climber, you've got to be good as well. My training for Australia in general was built around a trip to Taipan, so for that I was doing a lot of power endurance training, a lot of boulder on edges and just trying uh, to focus more specifically on the style for that. A few weeks before that, that I found out that I wouldn't be able to go to Taipan wall, so you know that training just had to had to be okay for going to uh, going for to Rapalies and climbing punks. Uh, the next big plan is the Dolomites. I'm actually going out with an Australian friend, Logan Barber, who I belayed him on his ascent of punks and gym as well. So we're planning on doing Bella Vista. I don't quite know how it's going to go. It's something completely different to anything I'm used to, and um, it's going to be an adventure, and that's what I'm really looking forward to. I might get totally out of my depth, but you never really know unless you put yourself out there, so that's what I'm going to do. Graded 511D, that's about 7A in European terms. The route is virtually horizontal for its entire